Uh, friends, we use Java on various operating systems like Windows, Unix, Linux. Um, there is a need for us to know whether the Java that we are using is a 32-bit version or it, is it a 64-bit Java. Now, this particular question bothers us and there are various ways to find it. Um, point number one, I tried to find a way which is common to all operating system, whether you are on Unix, you are on Linux, you are on Windows. But frankly, I failed to find a common, a single method by which you can find whether your Java is 32-bit version, 64-bit version. Now, if you watching the video has an idea, you know, about one of the methods which is common, please share that in the comment section below. Okay, friends, then I proceeded to figure out what is the quickest and the easiest way to find the uh, JDK if it is 32-bit or 64-bit version uh, on all operating systems. So uh, on Windows, uh, I found uh, this particular way which I'm going to showcase right away. I have multiple JDKs here. One is JDK 1.6, the other is JDK 1.7. JDK 1.6 that you see here is a 32-bit version. Now I'll show you how I, you know, you can figure out um, quickly and easily you know if this is 32 bit or 64 bit go to the jdk bin directory jdk home bin directory copy this path and open notepad file open and give the path to the jdk home bin directory and here it says text file there are no text file not displaying any so just select all files instead of text file and select java.exe so you're opening an executable file in notepad, which is weird, but you know, this is the trick, uh, you know, the way it works. Uh, you will find unreadable characters, which will make little or no sense. But what you do is search for this particular string and see if you find it. If you do, it means it is a 32 bit JDK. I've copied this. Okay, and I'm searching for it. And there it is. You see? It, it actually found it, which means this JDK, you know, JDK 1.6 pen directory, this particular JDK is a 32-bit JDK. Now, let me just show you for a 64-bit JDK on JDK 1.7. Why did I choose 1.7 instead of 1.6? Because I also wanted to showcase that this trick works on JDK 1.5, 1.6, 1.7, and it would hopefully work in the uh, you know later uh, releases of JDK that, that are going to come. So JDK 1.7 bin directory. Okay, copy again the JDK home bin directory path. Go to the notepad. Okay, say file open, give this particular JDK 1.7 bin directory, select all files here, open java.exe. Okay, and for, okay, you, if, you, if you try to search this, you won't find it, but if you try to search this, now guys, don't yeah, you know misunderstand this as t it is not d and t but this is some special character you see this this is some special character don't worry i'm going to put this in the description from where you can copy and use it so copy this whole thing okay and you paste it here and search and there it is you see this it means that this is a 64-bit JDK. So guys, this is how easy it is, uh, you know, to find out whether your JDK is a 64-bit version or, uh, you know, your Java is a 64-bit version or a 32-bit version. And uh, on Unix and Linux, like I said, I did not find a common way to figure out, you know, the Java uh, version on all different operating system. Um, if you guys know of, please do mention that in the comment section, you know, just to help the community. But uh, let me just show you on Unix and Linux. Okay, so this is my Java. The command is file, F-I-L-E, file, and then give your, you know, Java file path. And it will very clearly say whether it is a 32-bit version 
or a 64 bit version so you see how it e easy it is uh, guys i do not have mac operating system now if anybody of you watching this video has mac operating system please try this file command on the jdk and tell me if it gives you the 32 bit version or a 64 bit version for the jdk as an output if yes you know it will help others and uh, if file doesn't work try to you know try to figure out if that windows trick works you know where you search for the p p l string it was i believe p e string okay p e string so um uh, see if this works okay on the mac operating system guys i hope this was helpful please share it with your friends if you have further questions queries around this do mention them in the comment section i hopefully try to respond to you guys uh, have a good time